let's uh, make a new modular patch. Just drag the start patch necessities. Now we're going to make a dual synthesizer. This is going to be two instances of a synthesizer that's uh, going to combine two types of uh, synthesis methods that we've already, already learned. So the first synthesizer is going to be a bellish um, FM synthesizer. So we're going to take the, a nice uh, FM operator here. Where is it? two of them, and an envelope. Let's connect it to make a simple FM synthesizer. We'll just hear the carrier. The modulator is not that important to us. And the envelope goes on the modulator, and the carrier goes inside the VCA. Actually, it doesn't, it doesn't need a VCA because the envelope can, it already has a VCA and the, the envelope can be connected to it. So this goes inside the envelope generator like so. Each one gets its own envelope and we get to hear the second one. Now we set up a bell-like envelope. Add some more voices. Now we have our bell synthesizer. It's a very short and very minimal synthesizer, but we don't need much more than this one. And on top of that, I'm going to make uh, a small uh, detuned uh, bunch of three oscillators. This time I'm going to uh, I'm going to use a different oscillator type. It's going to be the wavetable oscillator. It has a list of uh, 128 uh, waveforms we can select from. I'm going to detune three of those, and that's going to make me a pad. I'm going to put them inside the mixer. And I'm going to use the poly filter again. It's versatile and it's useful. Now I'm going to mix between the two synthesizers, the bells and the synthesizer that I have here. I should have, uh, by the way, I should uh, add a, an envelope and a VCA to the second synthesizer as well. Now, let me tell you a tip. When you have two synthesizers and you have to decide which envelope you're going to use as the async feedback, then I would recommend using the longer envelope. For now, it's going to be not the bell envelope, which is uh, rather short, but our other sounds envelope. It's going to be a pad that's going to be combined, so it's a longer one. So I connect this one to the async. And now, with the mixer, I mix both sounds together before they go out into the poly out. Mm -hmm. 
Now let's listen to the second sound. Ah, it has to, we have to connect the frequency, of course. And let's, let's uh, select some kind of uh, waveform. Uh, and for uh, making the detune more uh, concentrated and sounding more uh, consistent, we'll select the same waveform on all three. So I'm just selecting a random one. Voc form 7. Let's see if I can find it again in the short list here. Here it is. I'm detuning them a bit. Let me operate the filter. a combination between uh, three synthesis types. We have a wavetable, we have subtractive synthesis with the filter, and we have FM with the bell sound. If we really want to enhance the pad, we can use two filters in parallel. Let's take a mixer and mix two filters. One of them will be the, this low pass, which will give, give us warmth. And the other will be another Poly6 filter, which will receive the same sound, but will have one of the bandpass filters or the um, or the phaser filters, which will have a nice LFO on them. be connected I don't understand the question the LFO does not have a gate out it has a gate in it receives gate signals and it should only be connected if you want it to be retriggered by the, the keyboard now one of the main uh, principles in pads the one of the best tips uh, I can give you is the more the merrier. Pads love to have uh, layers and uh, details inside. So I can even go beyond and add some more filters that are uh, modulating in the background. And of course, these type of sounds really love to have some chorus and delay. So let's just add uh, chorus at the and delay at the end. And of course, we can use different di filter types if we want a different pad. Yes, finely tuned chorus and delay can g go a long way with pads. And we can also use one of the phasers. Flanger.
it's time to save this one. I'll call I'll call this uh, synthesizer hybrid synthesizer. <laughs> 